The murder trial of 30-year-old Aldine Wilkinson has just been postponed to the 10th of October in Kimberley. In the Kimberley High Court, he's accused of murdering his 28-year-old girlfriend, Danielle van der Linde, in May. The incident allegedly occurred in front of a minor. The latest from SBC News senior reporter, original vet boy, from the court. They made a brief appearance in, in court. Family members of his also attended um, the brief court proceedings uh, earlier on. I'm joined now by the National Prosecuting Authority, Mojalefen Senokotswane, just to tell us why this case has been postponed. Uh, Mojalefe, a very good morning to you. Uh, we, we heard the judge uh, saying there and the defense and the state agreeing that f uh, this case will be postponed until the 10th of October. Why? As you remember, this case was handled by the lower courts until it was transferred to the high court. The thing is, when it was transferred to the lower court, which was the district court in Kimberley, uh, the dates for the start of the trial were not communicated with the defense, but we took it upon uh, ourselves as the NPA as part of ensuring that gender-based violence uh, crimes uh, take center stage and they are processed quickly to move it to the high court. Hence, you saw that today that the defense as well as the prosecution agreed on the date when the trial will start. That was just a, a strategic move on our part to ensure that we have a, speed, a speedy uh, trial uh, here in the high court. We knew that we were going to uh, postpone it to the uh, date that will be suitable for all. Also, from the NPA side, are you ready for this trial to resume in this court? We have been ready for a while. Uh, we are satisfied with how the, the case has been going. Uh, hence, we wanted to start it as fast as we can. If you remember, this incident happened in May and already we are talking about trial. It shows that the NPA is satisfied with the, the evidence that it has in its coffers and we are ready to proce proceed with the trial. Let me ask you, because in the lower court we also heard that the object that was used hasn't been, wasn't found yet. What do we know at this stage? Where, where is the object? Has it been found? Uh, you must remember that uh, all those nitty gritties of how, what happened, what was used, will unfold within the trial. So we can wait for the trial to unfold so that you can get all the, the information within the trial. Because it is only when the trial starts that you can only be able to uh, ascertain what truly happened and what weapon was used. So let's wait until the 10th of October. Also, this case brought to light yet again the issue of gender-based violence. What is your stance on that? Because we see many cases, women being killed by their partners. Yes. As you remember, the president once alluded to the fact that GBV was another pandemic. And as the NPA at the center of fighting you know, crime, we take uh, gender-based violence cases very seriously. Hence, you see the speedily uh, process in which we handle this case, which is very serious in nature. So we are very serious about him fighting gender-based violence crimes. But do you think the judiciary system um, is fair towards uh, these cases? Because I know many people are saying that the justice system failing them when it comes to uh, cases like this? Uh, I cannot speak on behalf of the judiciary, but what I can tell you that we have cases whereby uh, the perpetrators were sentenced to life imprisonment. So it shows that indeed, you know, crime such as gender-based violence is being taken seriously. Because if a, a perpetrator, like one in, in the lower courts, in the regional court in April, the perpetrator who raped an elderly lady from Ritchie, he got life imprisonment. So indeed, we are working together with the judiciary to ensure that perpetrators, they get the appropriate sentence.
Thank you very much. Well, that, that was uh, the National Prosecuting Authorities, Mojalef Senator Kutswane, just taking us uh, through that postpone, postponement of the murder trial of 30-year-old Aldine Wilkinson here in the Kimberley High Court. Uh, also saying that uh, the NPA is ve very serious when it comes to gender-based violence. Also saying that he can't speak on behalf of the judiciary system, but we know that uh, many South Africans normally complain about the justice system within this country when it comes to uh, cases of gender-based violence. But we are going to wait until the 10th of October for this murder trial to resume here in the Kimberley High Court.